Hello YouTube, it is Alvarlo here. In this video I'll show you how you can reset TCL phone if you forgot the pass lock or the pattern and after that how to bypass Google account on it. So the first thing that you will need to do, you will need to power off the phone. To do that just hold power, hit uh, power off and the phone will shut down. Once the phone is off, you will need to long press volume up and power and this will make the phone go into fastboot mode. Here you will have three options and you will need to select the first one. So hit volume up until you reach the recovery, the first option, and then hit volume down. Okay, so once you are in the recovery mode, you will need to use volume down over here. So you can go down and go to wipe data factory reset. Once you go there, hit power and then select again the second one, factory data reset. This will wipe all the data on your phone and will bring the phone into the factory state. So now just hit power on the first one, reboot system now. And let's wait for the phone to start up. you don't need to have a sim card so make sure that you have no sim card inside and hit skip on this option we're gonna verify that the phone is uh, actually google locked so to do that you need to connect to wi-fi and go through the setup i'm gonna do that right now okay so here hit don't copy Perfect. Okay, you see that uh, my phone is already locked and I cannot access unless I have the Google account, but I don't have it. So I will need to follow some extra procedures in order to get my phone back to functionality so it will f uh, fully work. Okay, let's see. Let's verify that it has a Google lock already and I will show you how to bypass it. Okay, so uh, now to get started, you need to go to the welcome screen again, go to emergency call double tap on emergency information on top and then hit pen on the upper right corner tap on add contact hit here hit don't allow don't allow and you will see settings on the bottom right so tap on settings and the second option will be permissions tap on search on the upper right corner and here type google play services Once you type it, hit search, and you will see that uh, the Google Play services will show up over here. The one with the puzzle icon, tap on that one. You will see two options, disable, disable app, and then force stop. Okay, once you do that, you're good to go, and you can now restart the device. All you need to do is just reboot it. Okay, so I'm going to do it right now, and let's wait for the phone to start. Okay, so here we are, go start, skip the pin lock, uh, the net mobile network, sorry. Okay, so here you will need to make sure that the phone will not go to the Google lock. So you just need to go back, don't leave it go further. Go back to, to the welcome screen. Okay, go all the way back. Perfect, tap on emergency call, double tap on emergency information again, just like previously. Pen, upper right corner. Tap on add contact and again you will see settings on the bottom right. Tap on settings. Okay, second one, permissions again. And again you will have the search on the upper right corner once you do that. Tap on search and type Google Play Services. Basically what we need to do right now, we need to enable the one that we just disabled before the restart. So tap again on the one with the puzzle, hit enable and now you need to go through all the way back to the welcome screen. So go all the way back to the welcome screen and then we'll need to go through the setup. So hit start, skip again the mobile network. Okay, so again here, you'll need to go back. Don't let the phone go to the Google lock. So just go back. Here, you will have an extra option, setup offline. Tap on that one, hit continue. 
Okay, so now it is on the time and date and it will ask us to set up the phone normally. All you need to do right now is just go through the setup normally and the phone will not ask for the previous pin or pattern or, <coughs> or not even the, the Google account. So once you do this, the phone will be just like a new one. It means that you will be able to reset the phone, to update the phone, just like a, a new phone. It will, you will have no restrictions and there is no way that the Google lock will ever come back. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Bye.